All right, y'all, so we going to Kroger because I want to get this Carmex sticker off of my damn car. I got y'all on the phone. So hopefully the quality is good. But I want this Carmex sticker off my car. I seen they got to get it off of vinegar. I could actually peel it off, but it leave like a little residue. So we got to figure that out. All right, so let's see what they got. I think I'm going to get, well, yeah, let's get an aisle first. Hold on. Oh, look perfect. <sighs> so we got our gooby gone. I'm getting old because my ass was like, it said it was $4.99 on the thing, it was like on sale, but it run up for $5.99. I was like, all right, they said $4.99. And I know I don't even do stuff like that, so I think that's so funny. Beast. I'm not free for engineering. I'm not playing second fiddle. Take a second, let me kill it. No nominations. I'm the abomination. I was tired of waiting. I couldn't tolerate it. When it's all said and done, I want the title more. All right, we back on the on the uh, camera. I just came in the house. I gotta get a white towel so I can get this gunk off my damn car. But I don't think so. I mean. From when I moved, because I was using the scraper. But, I don't know if I brought it here. Hold That's on. what we got so far, y'all. I got to take this M off. I can literally, like, peel this off. And I got to take these off. And then I'm going to spray the stuff to get the gunky. The little gunk gunk off. Okay. I got my tripod, but, hold on. Alright, y'all. So, it's the best lighting right here. It's the best lighting right here. So, I'm back in the house. I got my white towel. We're gonna go spray the gooby going on there and see what it do. I think I'm gonna take my um Yeah, we're gonna spray the gooby going on there and see. This one's so bright. We're gonna spray the gooby going on there and see what it do. Cause I want that Carmex sticker off. Also, I parked in the wrong place at my apartment complex and they put like a little boot on my car and the guy put a sticker on my window. So I didn't try to get that off too. I feel like the last time that happened to me, I used acetone to get it off, but I can't remember what the hell I used. It was something that I was like, damn, who would have thought that this would actually work? But I don't remember what the hell it was, and I don't even know if I got no nail polish removed. I don't think I do. I think I threw all that in the trash when I moved. Um, But yeah, we're going to use this gooby gun, and then I'm going to use a a debit card or something to scrape it because I ain't got no scraper so let's go out here and see what we can do so this is what we got so far y'all I gotta take this M off I can literally like peel this off and I gotta take these off and then I'm gonna spray the stuff to get the gunky the little gunk gunk off okay I got my tripod but hold on Wanna touch the world, I need a hundred arms I need a hundred bands that's the perfect storm uh -huh. Hey. Alright y'all, we got the stickiness off of here So I'm happy I got the Windex and shit I used the Windex to go over it so it could be Um, clean We got the sticker off the back, so it's gone Ooh, I'm happy No more No more Carmack sticker, baby Good morning, bitch I missed you while you were away I haven't talked to y'all It's Friday Let me close this up, cause this is a little ghetto um, I literally just threw this outfit on because let me zoom in a little bit. If it's some stuff on my counter, y'all know my counter in there get junky. I don't think so. Yes, it is. It's like some skincare shit on there. But what's up, yo girl? It's about to get ready to go to Carmax. I told y'all I was gonna tell y'all what was going on with my car. So I told y'all I scraped the bottom of it. So the undercarriage was looking really bad. Like bad girl, I'm gonna insert the picture right here. And I was like, ooh. And they go, they putting a new undercarriage and they giving me some Kermats today. Some Kermats. Cause I didn't have no Kermats in my car and I didn't realize it until I kept getting in there. Cause I, when I got my car, I literally was in the house for like a week and a half after that. I didn't go, I only drove like no, I really wasn't going nowhere. So I didn't realize I didn't have no Kermats in my car. So they ordered me some Kermats. <laughs> Bitch, so they ordered me some Carmax. 
and yeah so today i did my makeup like i did my face but i used to do my makeup where i just put concealer on because my skin is very clear so i just put concealer on blush a little bronzer and i did my brows and put mascara on i think it looked pretty cute let me know down below what y'all think okay i just got on here to let y'all know to tell y'all why do people think they know your life so people that i've known or know they see oh alexis don't stay in that same apartment no more this from back home not even here but i'm pretty sure people out here thinking the same thing oh alexis don't stay in that apartment no more oh she just got a brand new car oh it ain't brand new but it's brand new to me okay whoever has something to say and i was just having a conversation with somebody and they said to me i don't got no handouts and <laughs> i was confused because baby what the fuck is you talking about a handout just because i wear it well you may would nobody know what i if i'm like oh i need help with my rent or oh i need help with my car no or oh i need wouldn't nobody know because I hustle for what I want. I grind for what I want. I work hard for what I want. For, so for somebody to try to play me like I'm getting a little handout here and there or I don't have to work because I get handouts, I was just confused. Um, I've manifested the things that I have and I've worked hard for the things that I have. And don't ever, I said all that to say, don't ever let nobody make you feel like the thing that you have just cause they not there and they not and they don't have what you have and they can't understand what you have and what you do for a living and they don't understand, they don't have nothing to do with you. <laughs> it's none of your business. If you're not my man, you we're we're about to build a life together. It's none of your business how really how I get no money for real. So if I have fifty three streams of income, which which I do, it it's none of your business. It's none of your business. Yeah, I had somebody try to sell the phone and tell me I had, I got, I, yeah, you be getting hand out and you won't be working. I know you lying. Not when I'm over here stressed about what I'm stressed about. I know you lying. That's what you won't do. You won't, you won't, you won't set me up with the games and the jokes. Where the handouts that you speak of? Yeah. Nonetheless, don't ever let nobody make you feel bad for elevating your life whatever you want if you can get it if you manifested it if you thought about it and you wanted it and you can afford it now and you saying all right bitch i don't know if i couldn't afford it but i'm gonna get it anyway and i'm gonna make a way then it's nobody business and don't ever make you nobody let you feel bad for elevating your life or for being better because they don't got shit that ain't got nothing to do with me and people know they will project project things onto you Didn't, You'll be projecting to yourself, baby, because I don't care. And you can go to hell. That's what you can do. You ain't gonna stress me the hell out. I'm talking about a handout. You sound dumb as hell. People be sounding dumb talking. I don't like it. All right, let me get dressed. Because we get in some car mess. Yo, I didn't name my car yet. I told y'all I was gonna name it, but I didn't name it yet. Because I don't know what to name it. Y'all don't know what to name it. But alright, I'll talk to y'all in a minute. I feel like I don't have no clothes, girl. I just be throwing out anything to go anywhere. I'm finna throw my little boots on. And that's gonna be that. Because I only got one pair of boots. I just need clothes. I need to go shopping. It don't make no sense. I need to do me some hauls so I can get me some clothes sent to me. For real, for real. All right, talk to y'all later. Well, in a minute. All right, y'all. So I'm driving to Max to get my car looked at. I am hungry. I really want some golden crust. And I was debating because I'm like, okay, should I shuttle back home? I kind of don't want to because I feel like last time they was done in like two hours. Then I had a shuttle. I had a shuttle back. I don't like really riding lifts and Ubers like that. Not that I be scared, but I just feel like it's so draining. I don't like it. Unless I have to. 
I ain't really crazy about it. So, what I think I'm gonna do is stay up there and just work on my computer. So that's all I'm gonna do at home. I ain't probably take a nap because it's so rainy and gloomy outside today. So, I can sit up there. I think I might take because I was trying to make a TikTok. Just doing too much. Doing entirely too much. Oh, uh, don't we be late to shit? Then we be mad at the cars around us. Like, speed it up. Go. Be mad as hell. <laughs> Nobody thought that you late except for you. To my gun and go. God damn. You don't know how to drive? Be going off. Mary really was talking that shit. Tony Braxton. Tony Braxton be talking that shit. He wasn't man enough for me. Why you. Uh, what was that other song? Seven whole days and not a word from you. That bitch be snapping. Seven whole nights, nigga, and I'm just about through. I can't take it, won't take it, can't take feet. it no more. The right I had about enough of it. Right. I'd rather be on my own. Oh, baby, if you start to get older and listen to them songs, you be like, woo. Baby, you ain't, right to you ain't lying. North Marietta, Chattanooga. You ain't lying. Seven whole days, sweetie. It be one day, and I be acting like it's seven whole days. Mm -mm -mm. All right, I'll talk to you in a minute. All right, so we got our mats. The mats they got kind of cheap. I ain't gonna lie. I might have to buy my own little mats to go in here. And I'm used to the all weather mats. I like all weather mats. Um, these are like the other kind, and my beetle I had all weather ones. So I might save my little coins and um. Buy me an all weather mat one, all weather mat, so I can like rinse them out if I drop something. But these are due for the time being, but they cheap, baby. They look like Dollar Tree. I ain't gonna lie. Look at them. Look like Dollar Tree. Look like Dollar Tree. I don't like that, friend. I don't like that, and I don't like that, but it's okay. Cause I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna buy me some all weather mats. But we leaving Kermax. I'm glad I just waited because it only took literally. I'm like, it shouldn't take that long to put no undercarriage on my car. So I had them check this noise on my car too. This car has a CVT transmission. So sometimes it like jerks when you change gears, like you like you in a stick shift. But that's normal. I looked it up. They told me that was normal. I looked it up and it is. And it's kind of loud a little bit. It ain't crazy like what the hell is that noise? But it's kind of louder than a regular car would be. So yeah. I'm about to go get me some golden crust. So I will talk to y'all in a minute. I'm about to call Q because she called me when I was in there, but my AirPods was dead. So I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Y'all, I'm driving down the damn street cucking the Q. I got the phone up trying to find the damn GPS. The police on the side of me. So now I got pulled over and I got to pay $50 for this damn ticket. It's $50 and a point on my license. What the hell is that? I ain't never had no points on my license. I couldn't even be mad when he pulled me up. I said, yeah, you got me. <laughs> I couldn't even be mad because when I looked over and saw it said Cobb Parkway, I'm like, I'm like, it said Cobb County. So I'm like, is this Cobb County that I'm in? Because I'm in Kennesaw. I don't even know what county I'm in. And then I'm like, oh, they can't pull me over. Girl, and I seen him behind my car, but he was on the side of me. Then he just pulled behind me. I was about to, he pulled behind me and I pulled up the other way and he turned his lights on. And I was like, you caught me. I was on my phone. I ain't even finna be sitting here like I was and shit. Cause I was, I had it up like this. Like a dummy. Just dumb. <laughs> he nice though. <laughs> he was, I just pulled another lady for being on her phone. Like, I'm like. I ain't got no ticket in so long. Like I haven't got no ticket since I worked for Keisha. I got a ticket for no seatbelt. I think that's... Okay, y'all. So, if you're not in the state of Georgia, Georgia just literally passed a law, like, maybe a year ago, of you not being able to have your phone in your hand. I thought that was always the law, because it's the law in Detroit, but it's not. So, he's, like, they're, they're really, like, buckling down on it and all of that. I forgot to mention that part. So, Q gave me the idea of when you come in the house, take, like, 
I think 30 minutes she said to clean like a certain area or like clean up before you sit down since you already standing up. So I'm about to clean off my island in my kitchen. Um, yeah, I'm about to clean off my island. I need to get some more flowers tomorrow for my island. Um, yeah. Yo, girl, is cold. I be having my heat. I'm cold. I be having my heat like on 85. <laughs> I hope my husband like the heat. I was talking to uh my niece and she was saying this guy that she used to date like he I never date anybody that like for it to be hot. I always date people that like for it to be cold and they put the cover on them. What do y'all like? Do y'all like oh like they like the fan on or they like the window open and it's cold outside but they like the fan on them. Like that's comforting to them. I've always dated people like that. And then I end up getting the cold because they got it so cold in the room. And I just do not like that, girl. I'll have to be warm. That's I'd be comfortable. I'd be underneath the sheets like this with the heat on. Then when I wake up, my mouth be so dry, my body be dry, and I'm like, okay, let me go turn the heat off. Girl, I can't stand being cold. I cannot stand it. Everything get off. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm trying to think of some TikToks I want to do. Girl, I love my fanny pack. I like a fanny pack over a purse any day. I don't know what it is, but I just do. But anyway, ooh, so happy to be at home, child. I gotta find me some Carmax, cause them Carmaxes look cheap in Dollar Tree. I gotta find some. I don't really wanna pay for no damn Carmax. I shouldn't have to. Y'all should let me pick the ones I wanted. Y'all bought them since my car didn't have none at all. Them Dollar Tree Carmax. It pissed me off. He want to do my makeup and then um i want to do my makeup and make some tiktoks but i don't really like doing my makeup in the dark i need to get i want to get one of those lights for your vanity one of those mirrors that got the lights going all around it they had some on etsy i really really want one of those because i like to do i want to do like when i want to do my makeup at night because i'll be using natural light when i do my makeup but I think that'll be really useful for me because I be trying to do my makeup at night now or I be wanting to practice certain look because I want to change the way I do my makeup. I like the way my makeup looks. I like how natural it looks, but I want my makeup to be more like beat, but natural beat like London people, like London girls, kind of. So I need to learn how to do that. I think I may need to try a new concealer. I don't know. I got, I've been trying to play around with it, but I really haven't mastered it how I want it to look. But uh, yeah, so. All right, if I got anything else to say, anything that's popping my mind, I'm gonna get back on here. I'm gonna get back on here. But, oh y'all, I tried this Trader Joe's coconut body butter. I did not, girl, my skin was still dry. And I kept using it, cause I'm like, I need to use this up, but it smelled good, and I don't even like coconut like that. It smelled good, but this girl swore by it on Instagram. Oh, it's so good, it's the best body butter. Girl, my skin be dry as all get out, but I just got extra dry skin on my body. I don't know what that's about. Like, I have to really use some moisturizing products. And I still haven't found nothing that I'm crazy about where I feel like my skin just be so moisturized. I did start, like, dry brushing, but I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of working. It was working the first day, but now it's back. Let me see if my legs can dry. Yep, because I use lotion. They dry. I don't know what to do. Let me know down below what kind of lotion y'all use. I need something thick. I don't need no lotion. Or I need to mix lotion with oil maybe. But I need like a body butter. But even body butter sometimes don't work for me. I have to put body butter on then put an oil on top of it to like seal it in. So let me know what y'all use because I want to know. Because I need to find something or I need to buy something. Or I need to go online and order something because baby my skin be dry. And it's really not cute on them legs. And they look like they dehydrated. And I don't like that. So let me know what y'all use to keep y'all self moisturized. Y'all body moisturized. Because I'm going to buy it. As soon as y'all say y'all use it, I'm going to buy it. Because lotion don't work for me, child. My skin be drinking that up. And I be trying to put it on when it's like when my uh, body is wet. But mm -mm, it don't like that. Okay, I'll talk to you in a minute. It's Saturday. I didn't really vlog when I came out the house, but bitch, it's cold. I came to Willie's to get me something to eat. Tacos. 
And, um, oh, it's cold. I got two tacos and, um, it come with like the chips on the side. But I wanted to vlog because I'm about to get a family dollar because I got a coupon deal that this lady on TikTok said. Because, girl, I'm not about to keep on paying no full price for no, um, washing powder and the necessities that I need, like washing powder. Uh, what else I be needing? Tissue, paper towel. I'm not paying for a price for that stuff. I'm just not doing it. So, I will be couponing. Y'all know, I, sometimes, I think I took y'all took y'all along with me before when I got, like, all that washing powder from uh, Target. And then one time when I got a whole bunch of tissue and paper towel from CVS. I still got that tissue and paper towel. I think I kind of ran out of, what did I run out of? Paper towel. So, I had to buy paper towel. But... Yo, girl still got that same tissue from when I moved. I had so much tissue and I still got like two or three uh, packs left. Shoot. But I'm not spending my money. I'm not spending my money on no tissue and no paper towel. I'm just not doing it. Why do we gotta even pay for that? I don't get it. All right, we're going to Family Dollar because we're going to do our little coupon. And so I will call y'all back when we get there. Y'all better pick up the phone. Cause sometimes y'all don't be picking up that phone and I don't like that. All right, okay. All right y'all, so I had to hunt this damn Family Dollar down because it's no Family Dollar by my house. I thought it was a Family Dollar, but it was a Dollar General. So, we at Family Dollar now. And it looks dirty up in here, but I'm about to get my stuff. Okay, so let me show y'all. I need to, I tried to brush my hair. I ran the hot comb through it, so my hair kind of too straight. I should have put the flat iron on it. Okay, let me show y'all the coupon. I'll screenshot at all the deals that I could possibly do. I think I may do Purex. I don't really use Purex. I don't really care though, honestly. I think I honestly want to do this Purex, Tide, Scott Tissue, Deodorant, and two toothpaste things. Then they got one with Gain, Purex, two toothpaste, and then two doves. And then, let's see, two, um, Tide, Downy. Well, I don't want to do that one. So we're going to do, <clears throat> I don't really need no tissue. Okay, I could do tissue later. I'm going to do Purex, Gain, this, and two things of Dove. So, let's get into it. Okay, so we're gonna do the game flings. Cause I like the little flings. I think these be nice. So we're gonna do this. And then we gotta get our toothpaste and our deodorant. So let's go. Okay, my stuff may be a little bit more because um they don't have the three dollar optic white. They only got this five twenty five. They only got this 525, so we do one of these and do this one. <laughs> Bitch, they got one of them. Oh, hold on. They got one left, so I'm gonna get this one and then I'm gonna get the charcoal or the other one. Hopefully, it'll work with my coupon. I'm gonna have to read and see. And now we gotta find the deodorant. Okay, so my shit ended up being like, what? 9, 10, 11, like $5, no. Let me look on here. It ended up being, $13 altogether. My subtitle was $11, then text was like $13. So I got my Purex, I got two things of uh, um, toothpaste, some game flings, and deodorant for $13, child. You can't beat that with a bat. Shit. You can't beat that one with a bat now. And this, this Purex gonna last me a long time. 85 loads. Mm-hmm. Can't beat that. 
So let me tell y'all what it took off. So it took off. Let's see. Hold on, bitch. Ooh. Oh, he got a coupon. I mean, I couldn't find a receipt. So I got one of the the deodorants for free because it was two seventy five. The other deodorant only took twenty five cent off. Um, cause it's a three dollar coupon. Then I got four dollars off of my D of my one of my two pays. Then the other two pays, I paid the regular price, y'all. And that's why my thing was thirteen dollars. It's supposed to be nine dollars because I I didn't do the gang fling coupon. Dang, bro. Okay, so I ended up going back in there because I'm like, if I got a coupon, but the coupon, well, if I even if I would have clipped the coupon into my family dollar thing, um, the coupon didn't work because I didn't have a 24 count and they they only had the 14 count left. So I went over there and I was like, dang, what else can I get? So she returned it for me, and then I ended up getting this game, this one, which is. Um, 45 loads. I ended up getting that child for I think it was four dollars because it's seven dollars and I had a coupon, so it was, I paid like four dollars for it. So, yeah, I really could have just not got nothing because I had already did the deal. I mean, but that probably would have messed up my account if I wanted to coupon again. So, I was like, let me get something, but yeah, all right. So, I'll talk to y'all in a minute and put my damn seatbelt on. I'll call y'all back. Bye.